Uh, hello, and welcome back to the sixth video of the 8080 assembly tutorial. Uh, today, we're going to be going over a uh, four byte addition. So, like, you can add um, an integer, a modern style integer, um, using 8080 assembly. So, yeah, let's. We're going to be doing add four byte integers with 8080 assembly. Add NCC sixty four bit integers, right? So we're gonna need three things. We need the size of. And that's gonna be stored in size. We're gonna need add end one. And that's gonna be stored in add end one. And of course, we're gonna need add end two. Oh my god. Cool. And that's it. So we're gonna add add in one and add in two, and the sum is gonna be stored in add in one. So LDA size. And let's make that down here. Okay. Then move B to A. So this is going to be doing load size to A. Move to B. So that's for the counter. LXI B at end one. H not B. Load add end one pointer. And then here we're gonna do the add end two pointer. And let's do that. Add end one db. Sorry I have a pre-computed number out here that I wanna do. Zero X a seven 0x5b, 0x2f, and add end 2. This is going to be 0xb8. So this is backwards. So this here is the least significant byte, and then here is the most significant byte. Um, b8, 0x35, 0xdf, 0x14. Cool. Then in a a, so this clears carry flag. Then um, L D A X D get byte from add and two. Right, and then A D C M you. Add it on to um, add in one. Okay, and then move uh, move the result to M, which is add in one. And remember, this is ADC. This is add with carry store byte uh, store byte to sum. Um, and then, so this increment add end two. Increment add end one. Increment counter. And then jump back plus 12, because that's right up here. Jump back to here. If, um, well, if you still got more bytes, then return. So that here is four byte integer addition in 88 assembly. Let's see if we can make something with it.
Okay, so basically we're going to add these two numbers. Let's do a forward reference here. Sum set one. Cool. Um, let us compare the last byte. Um, yeah, let's compare the last byte. Uh, let's compare the, the most significant byte. So let's do this. And then we should see if this is 0x44. Jz. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So if it is correct, if the sum is correct, then it will uh, call correct. If not, it will just quit. Let's see. Okay, so that was bizarre. Basically, I just have to fix some formatting issues. Apparently, the CPM compiler, CPM, sorry, CPM assembler, the one that's by default in with your Altair, does not support prefix for hex, so you must do suffix. And your hex number must end in, uh, must start in a digit, even if you have that end of the hex. The other thing is I am counting these wrong. So that's, oh, yes, yes, I was counting this wrong. This is one, one, two, three, yeah, okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. That makes sense. And that's it. Um, so just basically a lot, a lot of these projects have hiccups, not because the code is wrong, but just because the code isn't being read by the assembler correctly and you have to work through, uh, the 
little hiccups here and there. But that's it. That's how you can add uh, four byte integers with 8080 assembly. And uh, we have tested this by, by uh, testing the uh, most significant byte uh, of the sum. And, and the sum should actually be um, four, it should be four, four, three, A, D, D, seven, B, H um, is the sum. So that's what this should add up to be. And uh, there you go. Uh, that's it. Uh, that's all I needed uh, to show you guys. And uh, I'll see you next time.